Hi, welcome to Coffee with Chime. My name is Zach Donish. I'm the Director of Membership Services here with Ashley Jester, Director of Professional Development. Ashley, welcome to Coffee with Chime. Thank you for having me. It's not me, it's all of us. It's uh, great to be uh, back on Coffee with Chime. I think I was on just a couple weeks ago uh, with Spencer Stabler, um, a compatriot in the Membership Services Department. And uh, it's fun to be on Coffee with Chime to share great news with all of our members. And I think you feel the same way. There's a lot going on in professional development. And uh, Ashley, I'll, I'll let you kind of uh, give the, the brief overview before we jump in. What's, what's new in professional development? Sure. Um, so you may have seen some uh, announcements come out recently regarding our CHISL program. And that is our secure, or Certified Healthcare Information Security Leaders uh, program here at CHIME. Um, we partnered with AHES membership. Uh, working with board and committee members to really bring a solid certification program to our information security leaders. I know it's been well in the making and, and desired program, so we're very excited to have that announcement come out. Um, so feel free to ask any questions. Um, you know, Zach and I will be here to kind of answer any questions that might come through. Um, you know, we'll be happy to connect with you after the programming as well. So um, we'll go ahead and get started. Great. So just to kind of take a, a moment to step back in time a little bit. Now, I've been with Chime for almost, I think we're, we're, we're gradually approaching three years now, maybe, maybe a little over two and a half years. And when I started uh, working with AHIS and AHIA members, you know, one of the biggest charges in AHIS was to develop something that, that spoke to the challenges of information security leaders and that highlighted the effect on the industry that information security was having when you know, AHIS was founded in 2014. And uh, you know we had been speaking with the AHIS board for many years up until 2019 about this opportunity. And uh, with uh, Ashley and, and Chime's help, we've really been able to put uh, something on paper here that, that in working with the committee and bringing folks out to Ann Arbor uh, to, to work on this exam, uh, this is an amazing opportunity for our information security leaders and their professional development. And I don't want to, you know, bury the lead too deep here, Ashley. Why don't you talk a bit more about how we developed this exam, the rigors that went into it, and um, really, you know, talk about who who was involved in getting this off the ground. Sure, absolutely. Um, so our CHISL program is um, mirrored very closely to how we develop the rest of our certification program. So we offer our CHCIO program for our CIO uh, leaders, and then we have our CFCHE program for our foundation partners. Um, so our CHISL was, you know, no surprise to come out for our security leaders. As uh, Zach mentioned, there's been a lot of kind of forward progress in the making um, even a few years back. So um, we were excited to kind of kick it off this year. Uh, we had Brad Marsh and Toby Gawker as our co-leaders kind of taking that charge on. Um, and we established our committee earlier this spring. Um, we kind of put them through an intense workshop um, training here right at, at CHIME headquarters. Uh, for you know, de really developing and understanding what really goes into making a solid program, uh, you know, looking at the requirements, eligibility, you know, the the candidates of the security leaders that we're looking to recognize for those skills and experience levels, um, but then also obviously our examination is a very big component to that. Um, so you know, making sure that we're you know on target for um, reaching those those segments and and you know, bringing that to the, the industry at large. Um, we have seven different domain areas that we cover in the examination. Um, so the committee members work very hard at, you know, really going through an intense training here, um, but then also writing those items out. Um, and it's really unique because our certification, you know, it comes from uh, information security leaders themselves. So, you know, to get a really uh, universal exam, you really need to make sure that you're bringing in those people with different skill levels, different skill sets, um, from different backgrounds, hospitals, health systems, um, to really kind of bring it all encompassing so that we reach a larger market for our information security leaders that we're expanding this to. Um, right now, the exam is uh, going through another kind of intense uh, uh, review from our psychometrician, so we're looking to you know, make sure that we're you know, providing the best quality out there, making sure that the, the test itself is valid and informative for all of um, meeting all of our metrics that we want to meet. Um, so it's a really great opportunity. It's I've loved working with the group on just getting it to this point. Um, we have some exciting news uh, coming around the corner. So it's, it's been a, a great process. 
Yeah, it's been wonderful to work with Ashley, the rest of the committee that we put together full of information security leaders and uh, really all the, the board, everyone involved in developing the CHISL program here at, at Chime. Now, talking about the value of CHISL, when you look at the CHCIO exam, which is uh, the professional development work that we've been doing uh, with Chime members and CIOs for many years now here at Chime, many of you might be familiar with that or even hold the CHCIO credential. It's not just about taking an exam, it's about ensuring that you understand you know, the role that CIO plays in the industry, you understand the shifting forces that influence the role and the job description of the CIO, and that, uh, that you are ensuring for yourself and, and the job market that you represent the highest tier of CIO available in healthcare. And when you look at the value of the CHISL uh, credential, we're looking at emulating all of those qualities in what we do with this particular certification. And, uh, our, our goal is to make sure that we're communicating through your uh, you know, acceptance and your, your award of the CHISL not a certification, but uh, also just using uh, that as part of your title, that it is understood you represent the highest echelon of information security leaders in healthcare. And that's extremely important to us to make sure that you're reflecting on your experience when communicating uh, through the use of CHISL. And so we're extremely excited about establishing this program throughout AHIS, throughout CHIME, and throughout the industry. So there's plenty of value here and uh, plenty of opportunity uh, for you to get ahead and to ensure that others know you're an expert. Speaking of opportunities, now Ashley, why don't you talk a bit more about how our members can not only get involved in CHISL, but take the exam and prove themselves. Absolutely. Um, so right now we do on both the CHIME site and the AHIS site, we have our uh, CHISL webpage open so you can kind of scroll through there, um, look at the, uh, the program itself, we list different program objectives that you know the, the committee worked at making sure that those were the focal points throughout this entire process uh, to make sure that those are represented throughout um, the, your, your process of enrolling and taking the exam. Um, the application itself is live so if you're you know if this is something that you're interested in definitely uh, feel free to go ahead and click that enroll now um, and you know kind of get in on the inside. Now, our study materials are still in the process of being reviewed, uh, so those will be coming out next month. Um, but as soon as those are out, we will you know, be sending those notifications out to those who have already uh, responded with interest for that. Um, so that is in the making. Um, we also will be launching our first on-site exam following the system boot camp coming up in November. Um, so the exam itself will take place on November 9th, uh, pretty much immediately following the programming. Um, and then, you know, that's a, a great opportunity if you're already planning on, you know, being on site for either the Fall Summit or the CISL Boot Camp to really take advantage and, you know, save additional time and resources and, and stay for that and, and, you know, just take your professional development to the next level and be recognized for the talent that you already have. Um, there are other opportunities as well, so if you can't make our in-person event, um, we do partner with Criterion Testing Center, so that's a, a way to kind of take the exam a little, bring it a little bit closer to home. Um, and if that's not close enough, we offer our online remote testing as well. Um, so this is an online proctored exam um, that you can take in the convenience of your home or work office, um, and that will be available as well, uh, even you know prior leading up to our November date. So. If you want to, you know, take advantage and, and challenge yourself within the next couple of months to, um, you know, become uh, CHISL certified, you know, and show up with a, a nice ribbon at the conference, you know, uh, you know take advantage of that too. Um, and, and as we kind of or, um, mentioned a little bit too, is the exam is both, you know, trying to incorporate your knowledge and understanding in the industry, but also representing your experience. Um, so it really depends on, you know, the background that you kind of bring to it. Uh, if you feel that, you know, you have that experience and, and you're ready to kind of showcase the world what you know, you know, definitely there's not necessarily anything stopping you from taking it next month or, or in the prior months. So, um, you know, we, we look forward to working with you. And if you have any questions at all uh, regarding any of the requirements, um, your positions, anything like that, you know, definitely reach out to Zach and I and we'd be happy to help.
Absolutely. And just to touch on before we end today, uh, the CISO boot camp, which you mentioned, I want to make sure that I highlight that as another opportunity for information security professionals. If you yourself have uh, work that you do through information security at your organization or that you work with somebody side by side who manages uh, healthcare, healthcare information security, the CISO boot camp, which is a new offering through Chime and AHIS, is a great opportunity to come network with your peers and learn from some really high profile information security leaders over a three and, and one half day event. Um, the opportunity here, it, it looks a lot like the CIO bootcamp on the face of it. We built around a successful program that we know a lot about delivering uh, leadership uh, education out to information security leaders. Now the difference here is that we, the program has been built and modified by healthcare information security leaders who know their stuff. And that's extremely important when you look at the content and the context that we're teaching through. So expect a great opportunity here for you to jump in, participate, and again, bridge that gap between the fall summit or the fall CIO forum if you're a CIO, and the opportunity to take the live in-person CHISL examination on, I think believe it's the November 9th. Yes. So there, you know, you can spend an entire week out in Phoenix with us and uh, have a great time, learn a ton, and get to meet some great people through Chime and AHIS. Ashley, anything else to add before we close today? Um, no, it's just a pleasure, you know, having us and being able to bring this. I think this is something that has been um, more so than you know that members are are recognizing and you know interested in taking advantage of. So we're really thrilled to kind of be a part of that um, news to to break out and to really showcase and highlight our security leaders, which is are highly you know, needed, especially in today's world. And we really want to recognize them for you know what they bring and, and what they do. And so this is very exciting. And um, if you have any questions, feel free to contact us and. And definitely check us out on the Chime or AHIS uh, sites as well and, and get connected there. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much for joining us here today with Coffee with Chime. Again, Ashley Jester, Director of Professional Development. Myself, Zach Donner, Director of Membership Services. Happy to bring you some new great opportunities to professional development. Have a great weekend, and thanks again for joining us.